Hey guys, Foddy here with the first makeup tutorial ever on this channel. I'm doing Yuri Kotsky today, and this cosplay is featured by Cosplay Sky. If you want a cosplay, there's a discount code in the description below. So to begin with, I'm just putting on some concealer, and I use two different kinds, one to really more moisturize, and the other one is more of what I actually use to conceal stuff. And I'm probably putting it on really awfully and like in a really unsanitary way. And then I'm just blending that into my face all over in like a general even coat. After that, I'm going in with some contour and I'm just contouring my cheekbones and my temples and my nose and that's it. This is just some base contouring that I like to do and I'm just blending that out afterwards with some powder. Going into the eyes, I'm going in with a light nude color to kind of just make my eyes seem deeper set than they are and give them a little bit of dimension. Now we're going in with some black eyeshadow to get my eyebrows to match my hair color. Some people like to completely redo their eyebrow shape for cosplays for Yuri Kotsky. I think my eyebrow shape works fine for him. There are some cosplays that I would do that for, but not this one. That eyebrow shape is really up to you in the end, so make it whatever shape you like. in with some concealer under my eyes to catch any fallout from that eyeshadow, but also just to highlight underneath my eyes and the bridge of my nose. I'm just going in and generally brushing it in, I guess. Going in with some eyeliner. I'm doing a very small winged eyeliner. It's not a cat eye. It doesn't go upwards. It kind of just follows the line of my eye outwards to make it slantier and longer looking. And I'm also going over the top of my eye with a very thin line just to give it that black outline like in the anime. Since Yuri Kotsky's a guy, I try to keep it pretty minimal on the eyes and do nothing crazy. But at the end of the day, how much eyeliner you want to use is up to you. And then I'm just going in with some white eyeshadow to highlight my brow bone a little bit and continue making my eyes slightly deeper set and give them more dimension. And then I'm going in with some of that eyeshadow that's the same color I used on my eyelids just to contour my nose further. I'll go in with some powder again and just blend in that contour. I like my contour to be pretty subtle, so I blend it in quite a bit. And then with some pencil eyeliner, I'm going in and making my eyes a little pointier on the very inside of them and also going in the waterline with some black to give it that more anime black outlined look and make the eyes pop a little bit more. And then I realized I went a little too dark, so I'm just blending it out a little bit on my waterline. And I'm going in with some black mascara because my eyelashes are pretty light to begin with. If you have dark eyelashes already, you don't have to do this step, but I like mine to match the color of the wig. Then it's a wig cap time. This is uh, quickly how you put on a wig cap. You just pull it over your head like so. And I forgot to put on highlighter, so I'm just doing that really quick. And then I'm going in with some black eyeshadow again, the same stuff I used on my eyebrows, and giving myself some sideburns, just because with the wig that I've got, it looks a little awkward if they're not there. I think it looks more natural this way. I'm doing this a bit sloppily because for this wig it doesn't really matter how neat these are. 
but for other wigs it can matter. Also, if you haven't done this before, I suggest doing this with the wig on to make sure you don't make it look odd. I know what this wig looks like on me. So then I'm putting on the wig, and this wig for Yuri Kotsky is the same as my Roy Mustang wig, so I'm gonna try and style the bangs a little more like Yuri Kotsky instead of leaving them straight down like I do for Roy. But I don't hairspray them or anything because this wig kind of just stays wherever I put it. It's not a big deal to me, nor am I going to a convention, but you might want to hairspray it. Add the glasses on, and now I look more like Yuri Kotsky than I do Roy Mustang. Here's the cosplay from Cosplay and Sky. This is a really cool, comfy cosplay that I've got, and I forgot to do my lips, so we'll do those really quick with some concealer. And there he is, Yuri Kotsky. Looking pretty fresh. Calvin, who am I? Do you know who I am? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> no, you're looking my ear. This is my dog, or the back of my dog. He's cute and makes videos ten times better. Kevin. Look at the camera. Oh, look at him. You're not a poodle. Oh, we're all blue. We're blue. Harry oh, Kotz, he's one of those cosplays that I kind of cosplay. And I've been planning to really cosplay, but still only kind of cosplay. I would like to say that I have no idea what I'm doing. I just put makeup on my face. I'm not a makeup artist. Don't think I am. Thanks for watching this makeup tutorial. It's featuring this really cool cosplay for Yuri Kotsky by Cosplay Sky, which another review will be done for. The link will be in the description. Also, probably at the end of this video, there will be another video, and it'll be that review. But this is just a makeup tutorial. So, here it is the makeup. What do you do once you're done with the makeup tutorial? Um, you talk about the makeup? Yeah, I usually talk about like the character of the makeup. Thank the audience for their love and support. Thanks. A little bit more enthusiasm. <laughs> so whatever comes to mind. If you want to do an intro or an outro. Hurt me, Shkoi. <laughs> Get out of my house.